Hello, this is Steve Pollitt, Director of Top One Coaching Consulting, JT Fox. This is a brief how to use Google Docs video, starting with first creating a Google account. To begin, we'll fill out the form. And since I'm not going to waste your time while I do this, I'm just going to pause this and then we'll continue. Now I do want to alert you before going too far to scroll down and look at the uh, CAPTCHA code. And this is the code that you have to enter to verify that helps Google determine that you're not a spammer. So the reason I encourage you to do this is because if you're not able to read this code, what you should do is go to the top of your screen and refresh the screen and refresh it until you can read the code okay so I'm just doing this right now because I've been through this where you felt the entire form and then you cannot read the code and that's a problem so I'm just going to continue here until I'm convinced I can read the code and type in the letters and you can see that I'm clicking through this a lot because Google has a very difficult CAPTCHA code and I want to be able to read it and uh, be able to enter the code correctly so I can continue. So once I do this I'm going to, pa I'm going to pause now while I continue this until I find a code I can read and then we'll go forward. Now that I found a uh, code that I can read, I'm going to go back and complete filling out the form. You can see I've added my name and I've selected a desired login name. So you can see directortop1 at gmail.com, checking the available availability and that is available. Getting an available uh, username can be a little challenging, so just play with it and go from there. But they are available and this is important. So. Now I'm going to f finish the rest of the form and come back to you. Success. Now we'll move forward. Show me my account. And um, let's move forward here. They have a couple screens. And what I'm going to do is click just go to my inbox. And now you see uh, the beginning of the of your account with Gmail. So this is what's important. This is your Gmail account. This is your this is your email account. And what I want to focus on for this purposes of this video video right now is this area right up here where it says documents. Okay. So we're going to click on documents. What was happening there is when I clicked on documents, it was asking me for my password, which I gave it. So now I'm, I'm at the Google Docs section. And what I want to show you is that in Google Docs, right here, create new, create new. Uh, and in this example, I'm going to create a new document. And so here we go, create a new document. There's the screen. And now I'm going to click on file and I'm going to click rename okay now this screen comes up and I'm going to rename this for purposes of this example top five okay so now I click OK and so now I can work in this document uh, this doc I can work in this document this, this works pretty much like a uh, Microsoft Word so I'm going to set this up, top five, and I'm going to put in, uh, I'm just going to put March, uh, today's, uh, let me rephrase that, today's date, top five. So obviously you're going to type in today's date, whatever that is. And I'm going to create another section. So you notice I'm scrolling down and and complete it okay so now here in this section for purposes of this example I'm outlining the top five priorities that I want to accomplish today and so for example 
um, I'm going to use training video for um, uh, for coaching clients. Okay, so you can put in there obviously your top five, and um, now I'm going to move over here and show you this section, which is important. Now, uh, uh, just a second ago, this area right in here was live. It says saved. Now, Google automatically saves your work, which is really cool. So there's nothing for me to save, but what I want to point out to you is um, this share button. Okay, so if you're working with other people, and which most of us are, we're going to use this share. So when you create your top five, you click on share, and the first line is invite people. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, let me adjust the screen here so you can see this, invite people, and I'm going to invite, I'll use myself as an example, um, uh, Steve at jtfoxorg.com. Okay? And I'm going to allow Steve, which of course is me, to edit. Now, if I want to share this with somebody who I just want them to be able to view it, then I'm going to cl click the view section. And then finally, when I'm all done with that, um, I'm going to click send. And then that's shared. And Steve will get a message asking him if he, uh, inviting him to view this document, and then we click save and close, okay? Now in closing, I just want to sh point out a few things. One is, here is the calendar feature of Google, and in the uh, documents section of Google, uh, and let me go back here, let me just refresh this. So I go back to mail, I click on documents, and you know, here you can create a spreadsheet. You can create folders to organize your work. And there's a lot more, but for purposes of this video, I wanted to show you how to get started with Google Docs. Hopefully I've accomplished that mission. Thank you very much. This is Steve Pollitt, Director, Top One Coaching Consulting, JT Fox. Thank you for your time and interest.